wherever you are watching my video from. Um, I just wanted to make this video. I've been extremely busy, um, but before I go out and um, enjoy my day, I thought I'd make this quick video um, and just talk to you guys about some things. Um, first, I would like everybody to be praying for um, everybody in North Carolina in regards to the hurricane. I'm in Savannah, Georgia, so, um, you know, we need to be earnestly praying for all those people. You know, um, the most important thing is them surviving in their lives. You know, sure, you know, it's hard to lose your personal things and your property and your homes, but you can always rebuild. And that's the wonderful thing is that you can, yeah, starting over is hard, but being together is what's most important. And, and you have to remember that. And it may look really gloom and, um, I, and it's hard to start over, but you know, with uh, God's grace, you'll be able to do it, definitely. So please be praying for all those people. They, they need your prayers more than anything. And like I said, there's so much power in prayer. There really is. Um, you know, with my sister Starry, um, I'm going to let you, um, she's going to make a video for you guys when she's feeling a little bit better and, you know, tell you about her journey with this um, terrible disease that she had. And, you know, uh, when she told me about it, I was devastated, you know, um, I felt so bad for her because she's already been through so much with her um, biking accident that she had, and, and you know, I knew when she had her biking accident, you know, I was terrified, but the thing is that I trusted God, I trusted Him to heal her, I knew that He would restore her, um, He has a, a special plan for her, He really does. And, you know, he has a special plan for all of us, and all of it is, all of our journeys are not the same. You know, sometimes other people's journeys are a lot harder, a lot harder. You know, there's people that have cancer, terminally, um, terminal cancer, and yeah, maybe, maybe they are going to lose their lives, but there's a reason for everything that God does. You can't, you can't question why, Lord, why is this happening to me? There's a reason why things happen to everybody, and we might not like the reason why things happen, but we can't doubt them. If it is our time to go to heaven, then you have to embrace that. You really do. I know we are selfish. I mean, we're all selfish by, it's human nature to be selfish about wanting to be here because you're so comfortable with living this life, and this is all the life that you know. Um, so yeah, it's scary to... Um, to die or get sick and and all that but you got to remember that there's something better for all of us and that's being with jesus and, and being in his kingdom i mean how awesome is that i mean nothing is more awesome than that you know so we have to keep the faith we have to stay strong for one another you know i thank all of you oh, i thank you all for all your love and your support for my sister it's so amazing how you all love her so much. I mean, it, it makes me so emotional that you guys love her so much. It's great to see that. And it's it's hard for me to be so far away from her because she lives in Idaho and I live in Georgia. So it's hard, you know, that I can't be there for her. But that's why I started the GoFundMe page for her because I knew if I couldn't do anything for her here besides pray for her, and, and that's, that's enough. Praying is, is enough. I mean... You know, people who say, oh, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't afford to um, donate, that, that's fine. You don't have to donate. You're not at all. Um, praying is so important. I mean, there's so much power in prayer. So don't worry if you can't donate. I can't donate anything to my sister. I don't have those funds to help her like that. All I know is I can do whatever I can from here. And I know there are so many good people out there that are able to give. And that is such a blessing. And, it, and it's great to see because the people that are able to do that, that's wonderful. I'm, <laughs> I mean, I have, I cannot express words how I'm amazed. You know, I wish there was more people like that. And that's what we should do is we should all come together when we're all struggling with something. I want to be there for everybody. I mean, money-wise, I can't, but... You know, by praying for you, helping you, talking to you, 
um, uplifting you. That's what we. That's what we need. People need to be uplifted when they're in their darkest moments. They need love. They need Jesus. They need you. I mean, we're all brothers and sisters in Christ. So we have to remember that. Um, and all of you guys have proven that to me. By I, I read her wall and I read such all the wonderful things that you have to say about her and how uplifting you all are to her. Um, I'm like, wow, <laughs> this is great. She has some really special people that really love her. So um, thank you all for everything. And I hope that I can be your friend too as well and that I can help you in your time of needs too as well. And we can all be there for one another. But I'm going to let uh, Starry share her um her testimony with you guys. Um, I'm going to enjoy my day with my son. I'm just outside with my doggie. This is Danella. I have lots of dogs. Um, <laughs> she's wonderful. I love her. I love all my dogs. Um, Danella is very special. She's like my, um, you're like my therapy dog. She is. She's, <laughs> she's wonderful. And I got Smokey. Smokey's my old timer. And I've got Sammy. Sammy's my son's dog. But he thinks I'm his mom. So, but I hope you all have a blessed day. And um, if you need anything, just write me on my Facebook. Messenger me. Um, I'm going to be starting a YouTube channel. My sister's going to help me because, you know, I'm not good at all that. She is. So, um, just let's all keep praying for one another. And I thank you all. And God bless you all. And I hope you have a wonderful day.